Hello cadets and welcome to flight training covering the holographic heads up display version 3.3. For this lecture, <coughs> lesson, we're covering the main display features. Starting in the top left we have the communications panel. This will pop up when new messages are received but otherwise we shall cover this separately in a future lesson. In the bottom left we'll find information on the body, commander or entity which we currently have targeted. If this is a vessel we'll be given the details for that commander and ship including names, faction association, current ranking, wing numbers, distance, and a warning if they're a mission target or have an active bounty. We also get a hollow display of this ship, plus shielding and hull information. If targeting another station or system, we'll get some basic information here with the name and distance. As well as this, the nav ball just here will tell us their current bearing, with a solid circle being in front and a hollow circle being behind. If locked to a station, you'll also get some indication of the whereabouts of the entry and exit path. At all times, we'll have an indicator of our current position. In the top right, we'll have the information panel. This will give the current ship's name plus the current galactic time if you have it turned on. This area lists pertinent information such as current contact changes, bounties and fines both against and earned, and signal sources. In the bottom right, we have details about our vessel. Here we can see our current hull and shield strength, as well as power management. We also see our current signal strength fuel levels in main and reserve tank, and current status for mass lock, cargo scoop and landing gear deployment. We will also see warnings here such as criminal activity, silent running, and criminal passengers or cargo. In the centre of the panel we have a lot of information. Starting in the middle here we have the main three-dimensional radar. Here a white square or triangle indicates material, cargo or limpets. Hollow squares and triangles pilots federation vessels, and solid squares or triangles NPC vessels. A square denotes hard points stowed, and triangle denotes hard points deployed. Yellow would be a neutral vessel, with green friendly, blue a wingmate, red hostile, and purple a vessel hostile to a wingmate. To the right of the radar we see our current thrust levels as well as speed. The blue area here denotes the optimal manoeuvring speed. The pin indicates the current thrust, and this bar will fill to show overall speed. To the left just below the navigation ball here, we can see our current heat rating in both analogue and digital form. We hope this has been an informative lesson. Don't forget to raise your hand in the comments below if you have any questions. Right on, cadets!